Hi, I'm Naomi from Salad Stop, and today I'm here with May from Ground Up Initiatives. I'm May. Um, so Ground Up Initiative was set up in 2008 as a non-profit organization and hopefully we can inspire more people to lead a sustainable life. What differentiates Ground Up Initiative crops from others on the market? The crops that we grow here are mainly very localized. Other than the common greens, we have a lot more local herbs that Probably it's something new, something people don't use to see in the market. What is the farming model of GUI? We call it the soy-based farming. So in our very humble kampong, you, you wouldn't see a lot of high techs. Everything is really very label, very manual, because we see that as a platform for, for the community to come together. Can you also explain the process of growing blue pea flowers? Blue pea flowers is a very, I would say, common plant. Uh, you can find them in Southeast Asia. Typically, for our seeds to germinate, maybe it will take about five days. GUI does not use pesticides and insecticides. So how do you prevent pest infestations? Mm, it's always very challenging in what we call the natural farming because we do not rely on this chemical intervention to control the environment challenges. So it's all about eco-balances forever trying to understand the plant, understand the soil, understand everything under the sun. <laughs> Why is it important for Singaporeans to support local produce? Whatever that is grown near the space that where you lived is something what your body is accustomed to. And by eating locals, you are helping to cut down on carbon footprint and how you have, can help the environment. I think that's how we should look at supporting local farmers in that way.